Yo, time for a tip Tuesday. So I got a lot of questions on calf training. Calves out there are such an important part of physique. When you think about a classic physique, you think of a nice set of wide shoulders, tight abs, and then some diamond shaped calves. So today, we're going over exactly how to get those calves. All right, when it comes to calves, I like to refer to them as the two H's, and that's going heavy and high volume. You walk around on your calves all the time so they can withstand a beating. So the two mass builders being the standing calf raise and the donkey calf raise, you're gonna wanna make sure you're using as much weight as possible with good form. And by going heavy, I'm saying eight to 12 reps. We're gonna have some volume work in there as well, but eight to 12 reps, four sets, either standing or donkey. Tip number two, make sure you're getting a good stretch. The better stretch we have, the better contraction we have. So at the bottom of each one of these reps, bend the knees slightly, drop those heels as far as possible, and then come up with the weight onto your toe, like a ballerina, as high as up as you can go, holding for a half second, back down. All right, third tip, stretch and flex in between sets. A lot of bodybuilders do this. This is all about that mind-muscle connection. It's also a good way to force a lot of blood to your calves. In between sets, grab something, grab onto it, stretch it out, drop that heel, come up, almost like you're doing reps with no weight, forcing a lot of blood in there, and then also promoting that mind-muscle connection. All right, guys, tip number four has to do with foot placement. If I wanna work more of the inside of my calves, I'm gonna point my toes outwards. If I wanna work out the outside of my calves, I'm gonna point my toes inwards. Also, partial reps. You know, I talked about how important it is to do full reps for calves. I implement partial reps after I've gone to complete failure with full reps. Utilizing some partial reps in there can really help finish off a set. All right, the fifth tip, like I referred to at the beginning, we have train heavy and then high volume. So once a week, if I'm training calves three days a week, one of those workouts, I'm gonna pick a set of stairs and I'm gonna do 21s on those. And what that looks like is starting off with the first step, feet pointed straight ahead, seven reps, moving up, toes pointed in, seven reps, taking another step up, toes pointed out. I continue until I'm done with the entire set of stairs, that leaves your calves blown up. Remember, good stretch, good contraction. Let me know which body part you guys want me to give you some training tips on next time and make sure you guys subscribe and let me know if you like these Tip Tuesdays.